What's going on? Welcome to Argold Road. Oh, you're looking for the Avian Tour. Now Donna's giving the Avian Tour next door. All right, enjoy the show. y'all i know you've been asking for a tour of our 1973 avian legrand come check out our new jigs on the road so this is our 1973 avian legrand it is a time warp it is 25 feet i spent months looking for it this is our living room space our control center is up top we run the water pump have an eight track CB radio on this side, just basically storage. Storage underneath. We even found some cool storage in the armrest the other day and we've had it for like five months. We basically just sit here, relax. Sometimes I read a book, sometimes I have coffee. Let's go check out another room. So this is my kitchen. Uh, compared to the U-Haul CT13 we have, this is glamorous. I have four burners a little oven, baking if possible. This does work with a light and fan. I get all this storage up here for our plates, electric skillets. We have a refrigerator, so cool. Freezer up top, pretty good size, and a huge fridge for traveling on the road. This is luxury item. The tiniest microwave I've ever seen, but at this point, I would never go back to not having a microwave on the road. This is a huge pantry for me. We are on our last day of the trip, so it looks pretty empty right now, but you can stock a lot. We have two closets just before the bedroom that we keep our chairs, brooms, back, whatever we need in them. Let's go check out the next room. So this is our dining room. Now this table goes actually all the way across if we wanted to put all the leaves in. And we do have a folding chair that came with the trailer in 73 that you could put on the other side. So it could seat more than just the three of us. And we use this space for Daphne's homeschool or any work that we might want to do on the road. Let's go check out the other room. So here's the bedroom. It has two twin beds. We store all our clothes up top and there are drawers below along with water pump and whatnot. It's got plenty of space for all the things. So usually Daphne sleeps on one side and then this bed is for all of her toys. Let's go check out the next room. Let's go check out the bathroom. We have a full size standing shower, sink and toilet a really large linen closet, medicine cabinet with a mirror front, plenty of space considering it's our road digs. And this is the master bedroom. The couch is a dining room, sofa, and a bed. Trevor and I sleep here with plenty of space actually. So we have lots of plans for this trailer. The curtains, the sofa, the floor, the walls are gonna get painted. There's a lot of work to do, but for the condition it's in, we got pretty lucky. But the best part of staying in the trailer is this. So this is my favorite room of the trailer. Best part of trailer living. We have the vintage Coleman kitchen that we use for most of our cooking, honestly. We do it outdoors and then relax here to enjoy this. Thanks for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed the tour. We'll see you next time. So now you've seen our road digs. 
like I said, we we're pretty lucky. It's a time warp. Would you leave them as is? Or would you make a couple changes here and there? If you would, I'd love to hear what your first change would be. Leave it below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.